Welcome to Business Ninjas, brought to you by Write For Me, where you'll hear from business leaders who are out there growing their business and slaying it every day. Learn from the masters. Let's get started. Welcome to Business Ninjas. I'm here with Ralph from Recepta, and we're going to talk a little bit about Ralph's business. How's it going, Ralph? Good, good. Thank you so much. Andy, thanks for inviting. Pleasure to have you here. I'm excited to talk about your business. Um, tell me about Recepta. What do you what do y'all do? Uh, so at Recepta, we are trying to bring a, just kind of some innovation to the receipts industry. And we are basically uh, trying to get rid of all those uh, paper receipts and toxic environment of those paper receipts by uh, moving to the digital and ESG. Basically, we are moving businesses to ESG by a 15 minute API integration that we integrate and uh, we provide digital receipts for the merchants, which is the best alternative to the uh, paper, traditional paper receipts. Very cool. And uh, as somebody who spent a long time in the receipt space myself, building out punchcard.com, I have an affinity for what you're doing. I think it's really interesting. Uh, at, at Punch Card, we created a loyalty and rewards kind of capability around it. And I, knowing what I know about the level of detail that you can capture through uh, SKU level kind of data, I'm curious, um, tell me a little bit about uh, how it works, um, who your customers are, and, uh, and and some of the value that you bring to them. Uh, sure. So we pr you probably have seen those long paper receipts from uh, CVS. Just my long receipts, right? So we deal with them most of the time and we are trying to basically just, I think we are targeting to start this business with large companies like Walmart, uh, CVS, because last year Walmart only spent uh, $630 million on paper only. And wow. uh, the fact is just 93% of these paper receipts are non-recyclable. So for that reason, I think uh, those companies would be more interested. And the benefits we create basically for customers and merchants, right? For customers, basically we make all the receipts, we collect all the receipts in one platform and make it accessible anytime, anywhere. And uh, we do not ask customers to provide any email or uh, phone number, right? And so it means no more uh, email spams or marketing spams. Just Very cool. That. And uh, the customers can get more cash back from the producers, actually, because we let producers know who is the customer. is. And uh, for businesses, definitely, we reduce a significant amount of carbon footprint and printing expenses for uh, merchants. We save the environment. We save the trees. Very cool. And so, so how does it work? Um, you connect your API to uh, Walmart's API or Walmart's uh, POS system, for example. Tell me a little bit about what that experience is on the merchant side, and then also on the consumer side. Sure. For merchants, it's pretty easy. Just fifteen minutes. API integration, we do have open API, so merchants can uh, integrate and will be able immediately to provide digital receipts. And uh, on the other side, customers just sign up and link their cards to our mobile app and they pay like they normally do. And uh, once we got the receipt data from the Walmart, let's say, we uh, link it seamlessly uh, with a basically that uh, matching uh, API and we uh, link the receipt to the customer's account. And we do own the uh, patent for that matching. Nice. And so um, so tell me, about, how did you start the company? People are always so interested in the origin story of a business and you started with an idea one day. Um, tell me how you started the, the company and what inspired this direction. Sure. I was working at AWS startup actually uh, in 2017, and I was dealing with expense reimbursements just for almost two years. Uh, 
And after that, with heat touch is the same thing. Uh, a lot of people traveling and we were doing, uh, as I was a financial analyst and uh, senior accountants there. So I was dealing with expense reimbursements and I noticed that there should be a way to get rid of these paper receipts. And uh, I know it's obvious that, and I noticed personally that a lot of people throwing away all those paper receipts as soon as they just kind of went out of the door in the markets or pharmacies. So I came up, did some research and saw that, uh, yeah, there, there is an easy way to do that, to digitalize that, but uh, no one is doing that. And uh, I left my job at Lyft, uh, which is a ride share company. And I left my job basically to start this company. Very cool. And so, um, so tell me about where you are in the life cycle of the business. Uh, sure. Uh, currently, just uh, we, I think we basically uh, a few months back, we were just competing at uh, one of the largest uh, tech events in the Middle East, and we won that competition. And we started uh, basically this project with the government of Azerbaijan to do that countrywide there, just to pilot. And at the same time, we are uh, negotiating uh, testing options with Walmart. Uh, Target and uh, one company in United Kingdom. Very cool. I love it. Uh, it. It seems to me that another benefit for the merchants once they connect to your API is that you know they'll have consumers connect their credit cards as well. So to make subsequent transactions, it could be it could be easy. Consumers don't have to enter their credit card again to buy something. Are you interacting on that side of the the equation as well? Uh, yes, definitely. Our just kind of basically our on phase one, we are planning just kind of uh, actually on the receptor, you don't you just need once uh, to add your cards once and mm -hmm. that's it. But going forward, what we are trying to do, we are adding all those uh, reward cards as well. So there is no need to ca carry all those reward cards. And at the same time, in that basically on phase two, we are planning just kind of to do the payments as well through the uh, our app with just kind of some simple code or something like that. Nice, nice. And so, how are you generating revenue in the company, and what's the what's the business model? Okay, our business model is basically just kind of simple uh, merchant subscription model, where we provide a digital receipt API, and which doesn't require any new device or ERP integration. It's like I mentioned, it's 15 minute integration, which gives them some uh, other benefits as well, like price comparison with just simply scanning the barcode, merchants can uh, compare the price with other competitors. And uh, this is basically merchant uh, subscription model. And other than that, we do some big data revenue because there is a huge data on those paper receipts. And that's where we generate some revenue. We do some uh, SaaS to the banks. We attach those receipts to the bank transactions. So you can see all your receipts on your banking gap as well, in case you need. And I we see. lastly, we do offer some loyalty programs as well. I see. And so with the big data kind of model, tell me more a little bit about that. What's What's the... What's the who's the customer for that and what's the revenue opportunity? Okay, so the customers there are merchants and marketing agencies. Uh, basically, it's an, based on we derive the data from those receipts and we create some analytical dashboards. And those dashboards reflect our sales by uh, demographics and region, uh, most visited hours, and automated loyalty. Uh, price comparison feature, and then uh, setting some price alerts. Let's say the price changed and they can get some information about that. Uh, they'll see the, their uh, revenue, number of new customers, and uh, number of receipts, customer satisfaction, all this data in one uh, basically analytical dashboard. And uh, we do currently work in Azerbaijan, we do currently work with uh, large companies, marketing agencies to basically to use that, these analytical dashboards. It's really interesting. Um, 
and what verticals are you servicing? Is it mostly brick and mortar kind of businesses or is it uh, other companies as well? It's basically other companies as well. We do just kind of in all verticals and we are pretty flexible on that. I see. What's your what's your go-to-market strategy? How are you getting you know your your clients and how are you getting the word out there? Okay, yeah, the marketing strategy probably uh, it's more uh, to acquire some merchants. We do some free trials and we uh, basically do some as we are part of some lot really big programs like in Nvidia Inception, uh, Plug and Play Marketplace. That's how we do acquire merchants and uh, for customer acquisition, we more use merchants to promote these because we save a lot of money for merchants. Just to give you some numbers, uh, each paper receipt costs around five cents for just average business size. And we just kind of provide these digital receipts only for just little small fraction of that, just maybe 10 times cheaper and it's more sustainable. That makes sense. That's very cool. And so, uh, so if you're looking out a year from now, what, what's something that you'd like to be celebrating? Uh, probably just kind of being, seeing people using our app and not just kind of, we are not cutting any trees. And let's say just kind of probably going to CVS and seeing those people just kind of using our mobile app instead of so getting those mile long visits. <laughs> I love it. I love it. And so Ralph, how do people find you? What's, what's your URL and how do they get in touch with you? Okay. So it will just kind of anytime use our just uh, receptor, the R C E R E C E P T A P P dot com or just kind of, uh, can email me at ralph at receptapp.com anytime. I would be more than happy just kind of to give more information about what we do and uh, help somehow. Wonderful. Well, thanks so much. This has been really interesting. I'm glad to see you innovating in the receipt space. I know it well, and it's, it's really exciting to see the next generation here uh, do something interesting in that space. Congratulations. Thank you, so, thank you so much. I really appreciate your time and invite. My pleasure. Thank you.